So we're looking at doing a six meter by three meter tiny home. And yeah, we're basically standing on the deck right now. Super tiny, <laughs> like it's gonna have to fit in here. Yeah. <laughs> so six by three? Yes. Can we just pace that out? Go yeah. for it. Four, five, six. six. Yes. Yep. Three. There yes. it is. This is it. That's it. It'll That's be it. Here. It's all happening in here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> have a little deck off to the side. It's a smidge bigger than a car park. Yeah. 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 A car space, right? And yeah. so have you done any plans then? Have you got drawings? Well, kind of. Oh, something in your back pocket? We, <laughs> we started off with this. Oh. This is something that you've done, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Well, These look quite simple. Yeah. <laughs> no, definitely simple. <laughs> it looks very rustic. I must say, I have a few doubts because tackling a tiny house with back-of-the-envelope sketches and pre-loved materials is no small undertaking. The plan is that concrete foundations will support timber bearers and joists, stud walls, cement sheet cladding and second-hand double-glazed windows throughout, if they can lay their hands on them. Inside, an open-plan room with a king-size bed at one end and dining and kitchenette plus small bathroom at the other will all be furnished with upcycled treasures, including a Dutch split door that opens to the outside deck. But on their tiny budget, it will take a wing and a prayer to bring it all home with a fire pit, an outdoor shower, alongside the locally commissioned angel mural. So how much are you imagining for the whole project? Uh, 35,000, I think. Yeah, we should. $35,000, yeah. That's incredibly small.